Hi everyone, Dr. Enrico Dolcecore here from Full Life Chiropractic. Today's topic, inflammation. What is it really? Where do we get inflamed? How does it happen? How do we prevent it? How do we get rid of it? Inflammation runs rampant in our society because of the foods that we eat, believe it or not, and the toxins that we get into our, our body all the time. So foods are primarily the number one inflammation causing agents from dairy to allergies to maybe gluten, some proteins. These things can be inflammatory in the body. So when people ask me the most common question, what's good for inflammation, doc? Should I be taking turmeric? Should I be taking an anti-inflammatory? Should I, what should I take? What should I do to reduce inflammation? Because it's really taking a toll on my health. And they're absolutely right, but there is no daily tablet or something to take to help with inflammation. It's kind of battling a fire with, with a tablespoon of water. It's it really, you're not gonna put out the fire by throwing a tablespoon of water on the fire every day. So it, that's how we have to look at inflammation as this internal fire inside the body. So how do we do it? We have to eliminate the gasolines and the flammable products that we put into our body that fuel the fire. So we really need to figure out what that, what that is. And sometimes it takes an in-depth look maybe with medicine or functional medicine to look through your blood work, look through your allergens, and eliminate those direct allergy-causing foods. That's the simplest way. Then getting into a hypoallergenic diet, which means reducing inflammatory foods. And of course, they're the things that you're thinking about. Sugar, dairy, gluten, and some proteins that may be inflammatory to you as well. So an in-depth look is the best way to really get to the root cause of inflammation, but also eliminating those inflammatory things. So the best thing to start off with is really cleaning up the diet. Then daily things like turmeric or curcumin, you can start adding these, these nutraceuticals to your diet that will actually help combat inflammation on a long-term scale. So curcumin or turmeric or the things that you may have heard that are ginger that are hyper or anti-inflammatory are great, but they're for long-term use, daily use, kind of like a vitamin. You take it every day over a long period of time to, to build your stores and have a base level in your body. And they're fantastic to use, but they only work when we have the flames of the fire under control. So I hope that was a tip uh, a helpful tip for you on inflammation. If you have any direct questions about inflammation, of course, pass them on to us. Myself, Dr. Lewis, Dr. Hafer, we love answering these questions uh, of health, and we're always here for you. Have a fantastic week. Take care.